is actually really quite fun. Oh my gosh, I look like a, an idiot. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I know that Halloween is approaching. In fact, it's probably Halloween when you're watching this. So I thought I better start getting ready some Halloween costumes because I have, well not a party to go to, Robbie has a Halloween party to go to and he has his, his outfit because he wanted to be none other than Batman. So he's got his outfit in full, which you'll, I'll show you what he looks like in it in a sec, but he's, look how cute that is. So the only natural thing that I could be is Robin. I went online to try and find a Robin outfit and of course nothing was going to arrive in time. So I took it upon myself to create something myself where I ordered green leggings, a mask, some black felt, yellow felt, a belt, some gloves and a red t-shirt and a green t-shirt. Like I basically went and did it my whole all by myself. I say all by myself. I typed into Google how to make a Robin costume and there came up WikiHow. And WikiHow has taught me how to, well, is about to teach me how to do it. So I even got a hot glue gun to try and figure out how to do this. So I've got my scissors, I've got my hot glue gun, and I'm about to get making my costume. Now the full version, an unedited version of this video is gonna be on my Patreon. So if you wanna see the unedited version, you can go subscribe. There'll be a little thing here and also in the description box below, so go check that out. But if not, you'll see a bit of a sped up version and it'll be ready to go. Buy a short sleeve green t-shirt. Well, I do have one of those, but it's not arrived yet. You will wear this underneath another one so that only the sleeves show. So you've got the red on top of the green. So I've got the red tank top, which I'll wear on top of the green t-shirt. So you'll, again, you'll see the green sleeves. Okay, so part one, tick. Two, wear a sleeveless red t-shirt over the green t-shirt. If you're planning to dress up as the classic version of Robin, leave the red shirt untucked. Okay, now I've got to make the actual badge. It says, make and attach Robin's logo on the shirt. Cut a circle from black felt to use for the R logo on the shirt. Cut an R out of yellow felt and glue it in onto the middle of the black felt circle using fabric glue. Then use the fabric glue to glue the logo onto the left side of the chest of the red shirt. Wow. Okay, uh, I know I always see people on drag race burning their fingers, but they're giving me little finger protectors. I don't know if that's the thing. Okay, right, got that on. It's all gonna go wrong, I can feel it, because like, what What on earth am I doing making my own costume? Also, I don't know if, like, at a kid's party, if the adults dress up as well. I should probably check that. <laughs> probably be the only one that turns up in a costume. Should I draw on this, or should I just, I'm just gonna wing it, I'm gonna wing it. Oh, oh gosh, that's not gone well. It's not bad. Now I'm gonna get my glue gun. I need to read the instructions first because else I'm gonna make a complete hot mess of this thing. Right, okay, so temperature of the glue gun will be up to 190 degrees. Insert the glue stick into the glue stick inlet and push the glue stick into the gun chamber. All right, move locations and I hope this will this is stretch enough. I don't know if I want 60 watts or 100 watts. I don't know what the difference is going to be with, with a gun. I'm going for 100. So I've got the logo ready to go. Now I'm just waiting for that to heat up. And then once it's heated up, it'll be time to use a glue gun for the first time in my life. Again, I'm not entirely sure how long it's going to take to melt, but I'm assuming it's going to at least be a couple of minutes. While that's heating up, I'm going to actually go on to the next step, which is apparently to draw and or paint yellow horizontal laces down the middle of the shirt. Add stripes for the laces starting at the top of the shirt. Classic Robin has laces all the way down to the belt, while the modern incarnation has laces all the way to above the abdomen. I don't know which one to do. Maybe I'll just do the full thing, because why not, right? I don't know how thick the laces should be, but I'm going for about that. So I've got the R with the thingies, and I think that's gonna be about right. Does that look like it's melted? Oh God, look how shaky I am. It's awful. Let's stick it down. Gosh, it's going stringy, this stuff, doesn't it? I think that's stable enough, don't you? Okay, 
Right, okay, this is, this is coming along. I don't know if these are gonna be even level, but I'm gonna do my best. I don't know about any of you, but I feel like when I'm doing this, it's actually really quite fun. Oh, that's why they wear those protective finger things. I mean, this is it so, so far. Got the rock in. Buy green leggings, tights or pants. Find leggings and tights that should be tight fitting and shouldn't have any pockets. Now the interesting thing about these things that I bought for leggings, they didn't have necessarily the size that I needed. So I've got age 13. Age 13 is gonna be quite a snug, tight little fit. So um, it will be interesting to see what they look like when they're on. <laughs> Classic Robin wears flesh legging tights or pants. But I'm, I'm going green. I've got green leggings, okay. And then on top, we need a pair of red briefs. Oh, well, I've got some red trunks, so I'm probably gonna end up wearing red trunks. You should wear a pair of red briefs on top of the green pants. Ideally, the red briefs should be exact color as the red shirt you'll be wearing. If you can't find red briefs, you can use red shorts. Classic Robin wears green briefs. That is the same color as the green shirt you'll be wearing. I like the red. Uh, oh, does he wear green? Anyway, I think I've got both. We'll figure it out. Crafting the accessories. Make a mask. Well, I didn't, I'm not actually making a mask. I've got a mask. I don't know if it's gonna fit me, but I've got a mask here, look. Oh my gosh, I look like a, an idiot. Um, okay. Uh, and now buy a craft or black belt. Robin wears a black belt with a gold buckle. A military style belt works best. I bought this. I bought like an elasticated gold buckle. And I don't know if this is the same, but I'm going with it for now. The to be classic Robin, you should wear a short length, completely yellow cape. To be modern Robin, you should wear a long length black cape or a black cape with a yellow underside. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to have a cape. because I, I didn't look far enough down to get the cape stuff. The next step was to get gloves. Now I got these long green gloves. There we go, so now I've got the green gloves. Basically got to put, wear a pair of black boots on top of that, so the next thing that I have to do is wait for the actual green t-shirt to come, and then I can try it on. And so I haven't got my green t-shirt yet, but everything else I have, and this is where we're at, okay? So what do we think so far? I think it looks quite Robin-y. Ish. Right, I'm gonna go and get my red trunks. Okay, so here they are, these red trunks. Of course they're Adidas ones, because what else would they be? I'm not gonna try it on yet, because I'm gonna wait until it's actually time to wear it. It's a lot, it's a lot. But, Batman and Robin are gonna be ready. That is for sure. So all of my things have finally arrived. All of the pieces constructed. I went to a shop yesterday to get the pieces that I needed for my outfit, well, the, the cape, and look at this picture of me doing that, it's quite something. Now, I am going to actually try on the full thing. Excuse the bags in the background, but, you know, traveling a lot, I haven't had a chance to put things away properly, properly. Robin, 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 Batman and Robin. Oh, gosh. <laughs> then put my large schoolgirls. Oh, leggings on. They are extremely tight. Oh, I'm going to a kids party. But I don't know if any of the adults are actually dressing up, so. I think I'm not gonna put my trunks on. I'm gonna put these pants on instead over the top. Come on, for a homemade costume this isn't bad, surely. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. That's not even a thing. Wow, I've really done it. Wow, um, I don't really know what to say other than I've finally made my costume and this is what Robbie's dressed up as as well. Wow. Wow, this you are so great, Robbie. It is Go and run and put them in the trap. Whoa. It's quite something, isn't it? Don't you think? But I'm here for it.